Well, this midday, we are following up on the safety of students in the Hickman Mill School District. This after a parent reportedly attacked a teacher last Thursday. Sayed Shabir spoke exclusively with the district superintendent. He joins us live now from Truman Elementary School. Sayed. Yeah, hi, Jiao Jiao. The superintendent, Dr. Dennis Carpenter, assured me that the students here in class are perfectly safe, and he wants their parents to know that every safety protocol was followed during last week's alleged attack. You may remember last Thursday around 6.30, police say disgruntled parent Simone Baker said her six-year-old son came home from school and said his teacher scratched his neck. Baker showed up at the school and eventually made her way to her son's classroom where she allegedly punched his teacher, pulled her, pulled her out of her chair by her hair, and smashed her head into a file cabinet before running off. Now, I sat down with Dr. Carpenter today. He said the teacher and principal did everything they could to stop this. They called Baker on the phone and asked her not to come and set up an interview or an appointment for the next day. But Baker showed up anyway and was able to enter the building while another student was leaving. The principal confronted Baker at the entrance and brought her into her office. But that's when Baker left the principal's office and sprinted towards the teacher's classroom. That's when the assault or the alleged assault occurred. Dr. Carpenter says this parent should be held accountable for her actions. This parent was determined to do the wrong thing, and she did the wrong thing. And I think she needs to be held accountable to the fullest extent that the law will allow here in the state of Missouri. Now, police have cited Baker with inflicting bodily injury. Her son has since recanted his story of his teacher scratching his neck. He has been moved to a different classroom. Reporting live this morning, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.